Good morning, young aspirants who wish to join the armed forces. Today, Subharthi Defence Academy is proud to introduce to you Ms. Ria, who is our seventh successful candidate who has been recommended for SSC NT Women and we wish her very best for her future in the Army. Heartiest congratulations Ria. Thank you sir. Very well done. We are proud of you. Thank you. Uh, we will just take you through the motions of an SSB as to how the preparation is done here at Subharti Defence Academy and thereafter how a candidate feels once she or he is going through the SSB process in the selection centers. So Ria, yes, you've been coached here, mentored here by the team of GTO, a qualified interviewing officer and a psychologist. Just take us through your success story that how you started your coaching and training here and how you ended up as a finished product and once you faced the interview, SSB interview at the selection center, what all did you go through? So you, uh, time is now yours. So it started with when I first started preparing for CDS. So I had no information about which uh, coaching or where, where, where I will go. So at that moment when I cleared my CDS, I got to know about Subhanji And I came here, I contacted the authorities so after coming here and before coming here, I'm going to discuss that. Before coming here, I didn't know anything about what the procedure is, how SSB goes, what are the tasks and what are what all stages are there. So when I came here, first they told me about the procedure, what procedure. There is a screening, there is then GTO, psychologist and uh, interviewing techniques and other things. So when, after coming here, I have heard that this is what happens here, there are many psychologists who do these things, do pictures But here I actually got the practical experience of all these techniques I, First day was like, okay, I'm literally in SSB, I felt like that And sir gave us the full liberty to perform Because sir wanted to know ki what kind of a person we are in real Then where, what are the things that we lack in and where we need to improve they all assessed us first and then I also got to know a lot of mistakes that I did in my screening and other things and slowly slowly by practically getting the experience of these tasks I got to know that this is my fault, this is my improvement ki areas hai. and regular practice karne ke baad. because in other coaching centers Maybe it's not time ka hini milega ki they'll provide you not just the 10 days but also you can come anytime and, and you can ask your doubts anytime irrespective of raat ho rahi ho rahi sir se kabhi bhi puch sakte ho so that what I did and sir ne mujhe ye bhi bola ki whenever your SSB is near you have to come here daily even if I felt like ki okay main lazy hu but sir was like insisting ki come practice because as we all know practice makes a man perfect and that's what happened here I GTO not in any of these tasks I was like literally dumb and looking at the task of what to do But now I am quite confident and now that what I did there in SSB I got recommendation because of this only, because of the practice Regular practice that I did here So I would say that this has helped me to get through the recommendation So you have told us about the academy that what all you have uh, gone through over here. Now, also tell us and our friends who are the aspirants, young aspirants, tell us about the facilities that are available here as far as the hostel is concerned, as far as the ground is concerned, as far as the tasks are concerned, as far as the PPDT material is concerned, all other material and uh, the infrastructure that is available. Tell us about that. 
Yes, I'll start with the staging process only. Ki first in the screening, we require a lot of pictures to practice. We have all the pictures along with the sheet, the same exact sheet that is provided in the SSB with like chest number and then your big box and everything. The whole same kind of page is available here and we practice only in that. There is no like, ki, okay, do the page pe karle no. It's proper like it happens in our SSB, proper in real. So we have those sheets, we have the pictures, we have the uh, screen which is my picture show karte, the proper timing, bear, everything. It exactly happens the way it happened in uh, SSB. Then uh, uske baad, we have the psychologists who consult us on the basis of the stories we make. Then uh, the group discussion happens accordingly. Everything, the infrastructure, the classes, the classrooms, full attention is given. Then coming to the GTO task, I haven't seen such a big ground anywhere else and that has also attracted me to join this academy. In GTO, there is like a HGT tasks are different, PGT tasks are different and grounds for all these are respectively alag alag. Then individual obstacles are also there and that too are quite well uh, managed everything and if I talk about the PGT and NGT, the scale bhi har task mein the fatta buggies and the plans and everything the equipments are different in a different task made according to the task we are given. So that is also there and then proper if there is any some I have also noticed ki throughout my journey, throughout the practice I've been made it here. Uh, there are times ki kabhi kabhi barish ke visit kuch problem ho jati, but still Next day we see that okay, that everything is fine and the fine kar hai. Uh, colors and the changes are there so that to make the candidate well equipped with the changes that are being brought even in real SSB there are changes being made every after every assessment so here also they keep changing things, colors and everything so which helps the wholesome process of the candidate so that has helped us a lot then uh, Psychologist, as I said, interview also, the interviewer is also there to consult you and tell you what to speak, what not to speak. So these are the things. Okay, and uh, you saw the hostel facilities here? Yes, hostel the, facilities are also there. And the missing facilities, yes. everything. And uh, also the fee structure. Yes, exactly. I would like to mention that too. Because I, I, was, I would say I was very fortunate because I am a ward of uh, army personnel. So I got this opportunity for free, which is like nobody provides you that now. And that two very good academy where I have all these things. So I would say I got this for free because I was a ward of army person and so they have provided this to us. And then hostel facilities also there because people coming from different uh, places who are not a merit resident or cannot afford to come here they will also provide the hostel facilities where, which is very cheap so that that is not a problem in fact i would say that it's good if you come here and stay in a, a hostel because it will give you the same vibe that you get in ssb because there also you will stay here learn a lot of things from your uh, from other con candidates so uh, this is here and very cheap so one can avail it no matter irrespective of where he or she is living so this is a very good advantage of coming to Vipasubharati Academy. Uh, thank you Ria, thank you so much for putting across your experiences, sharing your experiences with us and I hope all our aspirant candidates will benefit out of this and we will see more of you joining us and more successes to all of you who join us and practice here. It is. Our mantra is practice, practice and practice because practice means makes a man perfect. So that is what is our aim. And with that aim, we have here Ria with us, who is our seventh candidate at the cost of repeating, who is our seventh candidate and we are proud of her. And her parents are also very proud of her. And we wish her the very best in the future for her training as it is for a bright future in the Indian Army. So heartiest congratulations Ria. Thank you sir. So proud of you Peter. Thank you.